Hey Gypsies, welcome back to my channel and happy Wednesday. Um, just want to say I have a Dollar Tree haul here. So yeah, this is from several different stores. This is from when we went to Charleston, but there's also some here from, I'm thinking Beckley and Crab Orchard or MacArthur. Just probably every one of my Dollar Trees, honestly. So anyway, just want to say happy Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday and I just want to show you guys this necklace my daughter just gave me she ordered me one and her one hers is blue and she said it's made from mermaid glass I think she might have got it off of an Etsy or she said her somebody she knows makes some or something like that and I absolutely love it it's a choker and it just I love it and then I have this one here this is the one that Kimmy from Kimmy's Kitchen sent me and I guess youtubers are passing it around um so i'll be mailing it to someone else and i think i don't know if this is a thing or not but i think that we should at least film a video in it and then mail it out so i mean i just you know mail it out to someone else so they can film a video and it can travel so this is like the sisterhood of the traveling medallion right that's what we're going to call it sisterhood of the traveling medallion so i'll be mailing this out probably um, maybe Friday, maybe Monday, one of the two. So anyway, I'm gonna go, gonna go ahead, dive into this Dollar Tree haul. Uh, let me show you this Boro really quick. Um, if you're new to my channel, when I say Boro, I mean boring. So yes, I do, you know, I do repurchases and stuff. So some of it is a little bit Boro. Um, I just got this just to, as a backup. Sometimes I allow myself to run out of Tide. My hubby just loves for his clothes to smell like Tide with Downy, and then extra Downy for fab fabric softener. So, yes, but every now and then, or something like rugs, I don't like really want to waste Tide and Downy on rugs, so I'll use something like that. So I just like to have one of those as backup, and that thing will last me forever. Um, and then, let me just get this one here. It's on top, so let me just show you guys. Here's my receipt. If you guys want my Fetch app, uh, referral code let me know like I've explained to you before you scan your receipts for points that you trade for gift cards for goodies so yes that's an easy way to get free goodies and yeah okay so I saw these and I they've probably had these for a while these are just the morning glory they're eight pieces and they're just big sparklers you know you know the fourth of july sparklers but we like to go out like on a warm summer night out, out on the front porch and just let off sparklers just for the heck of it just because we enjoy it and we love the smell like does anybody else love the smell of letting off sparklers or firecrackers or anything like that i just love it I guess it just, it's one of those things, one of those smells that brings back childhood memories, you know? I'm always down for anything to take me back to childhood, like when life was simpler. So much, so much simpler. <sighs> anyway, don't get me started. Uh, anyway, so I got two of those just to go out there and, yeah. I, I, last time we did it, actually, I think I posted pictures over on uh, Instagram, so you probably saw if you follow me on Instagram, so yes. And then this, let's see here, uh, like when I got the, okay, I think these are just like all in different bags. Like all of the ones that I got apparently made it to different bags. So I did show you guys the olive green one last time. This one is gorgeous. This one is that, what color would you say that is? Like a dusty rose or something? I absolutely love this color. It's very, um what's the word I'm looking for? Elegant. I think it's a very elegant color. So yes. So I did get that color and I can't wait till I find all the ones that I got. That way I'll know all the ones that I need because <laughs> you know they go fast. If I don't get them when I see them, I'm going to miss them. So yes. And then um, this is something I don't know if I showed this one or another one because I know I've got two of these, like my favorite items when me and Fifi was doing our favorite items of the day when we did the vlog, but I know I got two different pillows. Just these are so cute. You hang these up, obviously, but this one says bless our family and it is 
just a white pumpkin. It just, it's gorgeous. It's gorgeous, and I do not remember them having these. If they did last year, I don't remember it. I might not have seen them. That You know, they might not have came to my stores. But some of the things that I'm seeing other people, like, post on Instagram and stuff, I'm like, oh, my gosh, yes. So, I'm actively looking for the hands, you know, the hand um, there's glass. I think there's a gray, a white, and a black one. So I'm really hoping for those. Um, fingers crossed on that. So anyway, <clears throat> I got a couple of these. So I have one of the grapevine trees on my front porch. And actually, instead of buying it, me and my husband went to the woods where we knew there was a ton of skinny grapevines. We got a ton of grapevines. We got one of the tomato planter things at Lowe's, and we made our own grapevine tree, which was a little task because, you know, grapevines, even though, you know, they, they are pliable, just getting them, I don't know, it was like a little task for sure, and I we use wire and stuff, but I have my own grapevine tree that I made, so I'm proud of that little sucker, but I haven't put any new lights on it in a while, so I really want to put, I'll start off probably with just the orange and just kind of do the fall Thing. You only get 20 lights on here, so I may pick up one more orange, and then I got a purple, or it's, yeah, purple one for like when October 1st hits, I'll, I'll throw the purple on there, and if I see a green, I don't know, I didn't see any greens the other day, but if I do see a green one, I may grab that too, because purple, green, and orange lights all together, that just screams Halloween, doesn't it? Halloween! Yes. And then I got these. I just thought these were adorable. I might put these on the tree too. So this is, um, this would be really cute on there. This is the light up LED skull lights. So this is the 10 count. I'm not sure how long the cord is, but yes. I'm like, give me those skulls. Hold on. Let me do it. There we go. Aren't they cute? I just love everything skull, you know, when it comes to Halloween. So, or even if it doesn't, like, I'm waiting on them. I know they're going to be putting out their skull scarves. It just seems that they put those skull scarves out. Like, yeah, it just doesn't seem like it's been a whole year. It's really wild that it's already a whole year. I mean, time flies. And then I got this little girl. I don't know. It could be a guy. I don't know. But I think I have one of these. But I went ahead and grabbed another one. Let me turn her on. Where's the... Wait a minute. Oh, I thought I was losing my mind. Uh-oh. Oh. Smell my feet. Give me something good to eat. See the colors? <laughs> Is this thing like... Yeah. I'm thinking it's like like motion. Does it say? Motion activated. Yeah. Motion activated. Do you remember saying that when you was a kid? I never realized how rude that was. <laughs> uh, okay. And then I bought another pack of Irish Springs, apparently. Irish Springs. Irish Spring Classics, my husband's fave. So I grabbed it. I didn't realize I had another pack that I just had shown. I don't know if I showed them or not. But anyway, guys. Oh, these. I wish that they put out a scent like they smell like. I mean, they do to like uh, maybe a um, six inch diameter around it. Like you can smell it maybe if you're lucky. Um, but this smell, oh my gosh, it smells just so fallish. I'm going to try it. Usually I set these like on the back of the commode. And honestly, I don't even recall smelling them like whenever I put them out. And then next thing I knew, they're all dried up and gone. And I'm like, I don't even remember smelling that. But, oh, I love the smell of this so much. So, this is the Bl Blissful Apple and Cinnamon. So, yes, it smells divine. Divine. Okay. Stay. Um, I also got these. Um, I love these anytime, you know, you can't really see. Hold on. Let me try to pull them out just a little bit. These are the LED lights also. And these would probably be pretty when I just have the orange lights on the tree. Just to put out these along with the orange lights um, on the grapevine tree. Or a lot of times, like, I will, like, on top of my bookshelf, like, or on my tiered tray, I can do that, too. It's almost finished. Like, I have to glue a piece and wait 24 hours and, 
yeah so i'm almost done i got one more glue which i'll do today and so tomorrow it'll be ready and i can start adding little little touches of fall because that's going to be the first thing i'm going to do it's just like pumpkins and fall but these right here would be really cute on that but i always like to put them usually I didn't have a tear tray. On my bookshelf, I'd put, you know, different, like, seasonal items and just kind of spread these out, maybe with some garland of some sort, and they're just really pretty, and I think these are a really good deal for a buck. They really are, and then here's a couple, let's see, what did I find? Hold on. Here's a couple of this decor this would be cute on the shelf too actually and this would be really easier on it because these are really light right now i got like the the part of the shelf that i have together i've got some glass pumpkins on there and i feel like it's a little heavy i'm just hoping that the glue that i used is like good glue so um these right here would be a lot better though because these are like super light they're like styrofoam or something they're super light so i did get the green one and then i got the gourd gourd yeah, it's really pretty. Like, they are, they're they super nice. Once I get these tags off, they're just going to be super nice laying up in there. Make sort of like a little mini cornucopia type thing. I got an ear of corn somewhere. I don't know if it's, I don't think it's in here. Maybe in this pile somewhere. But it's so cute. Like, I only got one. I probably should have got two. But, yeah. Okay, that's all the false stuff for this bag. The only thing left is this. If you watched our, um, um, vlog when we showed our favorite stuff this is one of the things that i showed um is these hair clips are they gorgeous or what i absolutely love these they're just so colorful and honestly i love the type of clip like that because they're just so easy as a matter of fact they're just so easy to get in you know and it just it just doesn't matter like they're gorgeous so i'm just gonna leave that in just for the heck of it and then they also have the rectangular ones i think i only got one rectangular one and I'll, the only reason why i got two of these is because i felt like they were different and they are a little bit different for sure they are a little bit different so yeah and then one of these but the other ones kind of just look the same with that i'm not liking my hair at all today at all and my gray is starting to show so bad yeah i'm not digging that i'm not digging that gray at all and i got a i got a box of coloring just waiting just waiting okay there's that Whew. okay let me just go right here i don't know what's in here let's find out let's find out it's tied off hopefully it's not a bag of trash nah it's not it's not Hope everybody's having a wonderful day. Yes. Pump day. Oh, I can't get... I don't want to rip the bag because, like, I need to put stuff back in the bag to take in the house. Okay, I got it. What's in here? Okay. I don't know what's all in here. First off, this right here. I got this for Jack because she has been wanting... Uh, another one and I just thought this is a really big nice one like this is just the spa scriptions it's not like even that one kind that they were carrying which I do have put back for Christmas so that's why she didn't get one of those but this is a really big it's really big like super nice I'm like okay she's gonna like that it's just the April bath and shower they outdid themselves because usually theirs is like puny you know what I'm saying puny but that one is a really nice size and then I got my husband and son. Like, there's no way my husband's ever going to quit chewing fruit stripes or whatevs. But, yeah, my husband, mainly my son, though. <laughs> mainly my son. Like, they, I'm telling you. And then I just needed some more sugar. And I don't really, sugar is something that we very rarely use. My hubby uses it um, when he has Raisin Bran. Now, question. I don't put sugar on my Raisin Bran. Do you guys put sugar on your Raisin Bran? Just out of curiosity, he won't eat Raisin Bran without sugar. So that's where our sugar's been going here lately. So I just got another one. Um, I just, I like this cane star. It's pure cane sugar. And for a buck, I just think it's a good deal. So yes. And let me know about if you eat sugar in your Raisin Bran. Cause I'm just curious, like just curious. Another receipt guys, don't forget. Oh, I stuck it in my purse. Don't forget. I can send you that directly through a, through a uh, comment, or 
if you guys want um, to look down the description box, I usually put it there too, the Fetch app. Um, yes, what can I say? I'm addicted. I started to break out in song, but I decided not to. Um, look at what we have here. We have a little bit of hard candy. Okay. I got four of these, and um, I'm not sure. I don't even know what color they are. I can't remember. It's been a while since I hauled these. Yes, these are beautiful. These are gorgeous. For fall time, this is going to be the bomb.com, okay? It really is. It's super cool. That color, these, these are just great. Um, putting the, these back, I'm going to keep one. Putting these back for my 14K giveaway, so don't miss it. It's going to be good because I've been getting a lot of stuff. I'm trying to find the name of this. Gilded Cocoa. So this is going to be the best fall color ever. I mean, that's a pretty color right there. Let me do a swatch of this. This will be, this one will be mine and we'll swatch it just to see. Gilded Cocoa. Mine didn't last that long. Maybe I'll just do a little, ta a little, a little taste test. Excuse me. Why? Why do you want to be difficult? Just come on out, sweetheart. This is a pretty color. I mean, I'm digging this color. Here we go. We got it. We got it. So, out of the package, it looks like that. Hey, isn't that pretty? Let's do a swatch. Ooh. Ooh, yes. Oh, I'm telling you right now, this is going to be one of my faves. I've got to try this. Excuse, excuse for one sec. Let me try this. This is going to be a fave. I already know. Mm, for fall or now, forget fall now. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I love this. Can you see? Hold on. That's a pretty color. That is a pretty color. I love that. Gilded cocoa. Who would have thought? Love it. Okay, so yes. That is something. Why don't you shut? All right. Okay, so there's that bag. And don't forget, if you follow me on TikTok... Go check me out. I'm going to be doing a TikTok of my faves. Usually my faves is what I do. Okay, so let me show you guys this. I found something new. Well, yesterday, okay, so I've already showed you these, but yesterday I went to a store and they had some of these. He said they're going fast and my son actually loves these. Like, they got that first box done and over with that first day whenever I took them in. So, I'm like, I should get some, some more of those if I see them. So, I just got one. I didn't want to go too crazy, but I did get the one. It's the chocolate churros, and this is Cinnamon Toast Crunch General Mills. I think it's 11-ounce box, 11.9. So, these went over really well. They really liked them, so I'm like, okay. And then I got these because these were new, guys. I had never saw this. Kool-Aid cotton candy. Now, Kool-Aid has came out with a lot of things. The gum, the jello. The cotton candy, I feel like there's something else that Kool-Aid came out with, but I just can't remember it. But look at this. I did get two of these. I got one for my son and one for Jack. She was with me at the time. Um, I'm going to put this in, like, the goodie bag my hubby keeps in the closet, if you know if you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. So, I'm just going to stick that in there for Jack. And uh, But, yeah, if you guys have tried this Fruit Punch Kool-Aid cotton candy, let me know. Look. Just, just look at that. Like, I wonder if it's all different colors. I'll be curious to know, guys. I don't know. I'll let you know if I remember. But, yes, look at that. So, I'm like, okay. We'll grab that. And then, this is something new that I had never seen. So, I always try to just look around in the candy section just to see if there's something that I've never seen. This is called Sweeto. 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 
um, fruit flavored sour straws with sweet filling. So it reminds me of those ones, um, what were they, sweet tart sour straws maybe? But this is made with real fruit juice, so they're health, healthy, right? Not. Um, but anyway, my son will love these, so I will give these to him. I won't put these in Jack's because this is just too much sugar. I mean, I know that this is pure sugar, but she never eats all. She'll take like two or three bites, and then that'll be it. But these, like, I don't like her having all that sugar. It's just too much. Like, yeah. She was like, are those for me? I said, no. No, they're not. Okay. And then, let me see. Oh, I found something cool. So, if you follow me on Instagram, you will see that I finally... I uh, got it together and let Jack make, with my help of course, those uh, Funfetti cupcakes that I got at Dollar Tree not too long ago. So yes, um, and they were good. They were very tasty and she loved them and everybody ate some except for my hubs. Um, but <clears throat> I still have to do the cookies and the Blossom Kiss the, the cookies that come with the, the Blossom, the, the Hershey Kiss, basically, that you put on top. So, I have two boxes of those that I need to do. I need to look at the date on those. But also, look what I found. This is a really good deal. This is a really full-size container. I, let me see. Best if used by... Oh, hold on. Let me, let me just grab these because I want to know. Because, like... Around Christmas time, we do make, you know, we do a lot of baking as well. We used to do more, but January. So, they're good till January of next year. So, that's a good thing. So, yes. Oh, shoot. Um, yeah. So, anyway, these are lemon cookie mix. They're limited edition Betty Crocker. These are one pound, 1.5 ounce bags. So these are full size, big old bags. This would be really, I mean, if you're, if you're like making like homemade, homemade stuff, you know, it's, it takes a little longer. And so sometimes you're like, oh, I'm not even bothering with it. It would take me too long. But sometimes they're just something so simple that you can do to make something fantastic for the family and everybody appreciates it, right? Or you can give them as gifts. Like, my mother-in-law loves anything lemon. Like me, I love anything lemon. So, that'd be a good little thing just to make up some of these. Put them in a cute little gift box. And boom, baby, gift. Boom, baby, gift. Okay. And then, I ended up getting, I needed another, my, my little one, the little Crocs that they had forever. I haven't been able to find a Croc in a while, so I'm like, I'm going to have to get one of these because some of my candles, you know, they're down in there. It's hard to reach down in with a lighter, so I, yeah, I grabbed one of these. I haven't bought one of these in like forever because I feel like they're just so big and bulky and like I have limited room anyway, so I'm like, whatever. Um, and all, my stuff usually gets taken by my son. He is a smoker, so he uses lighters a lot. So I went ahead and grabbed two packs of the regular. These are just the Scripto. I always like to get the cute ones, but you only get one in a pack with those. And he's just, you know, he's just going to use them to light cigarettes. Not, not nothing cute like candles, you know. <laughs> so he's getting the two pack. And those three pack, watch out with those though. Because like my son was using the three pack of lighters. My son was using one when he still lived with me, my youngest son. He was using one in his room and lit something, uh, I'm not sure, but lit something and like just threw the lighter down on the bed and that lighter did not go out and it burnt a hole in the bed, in the mattress. So watch out for those, yeah. So, okay, let me see what's in here. I'm in a different place, and I think that the the, um, the view is not as bad. Like, before, when I parked up there, like, there would be, like, um, you know, a ray of sunshine or something coming in, and it would just kind of not be good. So, I was going to go try to find me another place. So, I was driving around the parking lot here, and I'm like, I can go here because that look, that's pretty cool. Okay, so here's something glass. I don't know what it is. Let me see. Let's see. Oh, yes, yes. I thought these were great. I love these. So, I ended up getting two of these. Check them out. How great are these? Putting a little tea light or one of the flickery ones, you know, just that, that you can get. I should have actually got a... I should have actually got a pack of those. Yes. Anytime I talk and I hear an echo, I've got to... 
I've got to sing or talk into it. So yeah, it's just it's just part of my weirdness. I don't know, just part of my weirdness. But anyway, um, they had two different colors. Actually, they only had the green where I found where I found them all of them. And then I was over in the candle section and I found this one right here. So I'm like, how cool are these? Do these look beachy or what? Like, I think these are just so beachy. They're, they are gonna look so pretty just hanging on the porch. Uh, I, the, the echo's killing me. I just really wanna sing. Why does it sound that loud, like the echo? Okay, anyway, oh, aren't they gorgeous? It just says shore living glass lanterns. So they are kind of seashore-ish, but um, I had not seen these before. So I grabbed them. I'm gonna hang them on my front porch and I'm gonna put maybe some um some of those candles in there yeah so that's gonna be awesome those are beautiful i love those they, they just i love anything that gives you the feel of being at the ocean you know it's just it, it's just like a little getaway totally okay i got two more bags and two more items let me show you this item <gasps> don't fall <gasps> don't fall get, 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 get. okay let me show you what did you what are you caught on Oh my gosh, what do you, what? Okay, look at this. So I had not seen these in any of my stores. So this is just from the Floral Garden and it is the Brass Wreath Rings. You get small, medium, and large. And this is what they've done, just like that. I thought that's cool. Like that's really cool, but I don't really dig it. I mean, it's cool that the way they did it. I don't really dig that. Like, that's not something that I would want to hang on my wall. I don't know. But I have a feeling that you can do a lot more with these. Like, if I start Googling and Unicorn Dust Designs, which is also Shop With Sammy, she does some amazing DIYs. Like, totally amazing. Go check her out. Shop With Sammy is her Dollar Tree channel unicorn dust designs is her crafting channel if you haven't checked her out go check her out tell her gypsy sent you and you will not be disappointed like she amazes me with some of the stuff that she does absolutely incredible diys like i don't even know just incredible and most of the stuff is like dollar tree that she uses so like i know that she probably has a craft over there with this so i'm gonna look over there and see but i'm sure that there's a lot of different things that you can do with these so i went ahead and grabbed one of these and then i just grabbed one of these because i have to mail something out so i just i didn't know if i had any more and then um I grabbed this, which says gather together, and I loved it because it just looks very classic to me, just with with these right here. I didn't have this one, and there's several that I don't have, which I'm still looking. Uh, my friend Coretta sent me a picture of the one in Fayetteville, and they are putting their, their fall stuff out, so I have a feeling I'm going to be going to Fayetteville and, and Oak Hill and probably Summersville, too, over the, and in the next couple of days, maybe even tomorrow. But this right here is absolutely classic. I think it's gorgeous, and yeah, I was glad to have found that one. And then I grabbed this. I know that I got my friend who does the felting two books okay one of them has disappeared i can't find it anywhere and i want to send them to her along with uh some packs of the little bees and ladybugs because she uses the wings for the felt things that she makes so i couldn't find the other book so when i was out shopping yesterday i saw this and i'm hoping that this is the one that will replace like hopefully this is not the one that i have ready to mail hopefully it's this is the one that I lost. How do you lose a book? A book? How do you lose a book? I don't know. I just don't know. But anyway, I got that one for her. So I'm going to send her, hopefully, two books and those bees. So, and then I ended up getting this one right here because, just because, I love it. So this is what I was talking about. Like, I feel like that these are a lot like the ones that they had last year. Now, it might just be me. I'm not sure, but I feel like that they've changed them up somehow. They've done something different. I don't remember the blue pumpkins. They have a blue, green, and orange. I don't remember the metal leaf. I don't know. It might just be my um, memory, like, going bad or whatever. But, yeah. So, happy harvest and thankful. That blue pumpkin. 
is everything. Let me just say, I don't know why this year I'm more crazy about it than ever before, but you give me a, a truck full, a truck, you know, you know, the red truck we always love, red truck full of blue pumpkins, maybe a gnome sitting up in there somewhere. I don't know. It's going to be cool. Yeah. So another receipt, like I said, this is from a lot of different stores. So yeah. Okay. I got another bag. And then before I show you this last bag, oh, I see more Tic Tacs. Before I show you this last bag, I want to show you this. And if you saw my vlog, you'll, you'll have already seen this, but if you haven't, you won't. This is a find that was unbelievable to me to have found at the Dollar Tree. I'm like, what is this? I looked for more because I was wanting to share, but there was no more. So it says, these are Dream World by Emily Winfield Martin, 20 wonderful prints to frame. And when I say wonderful, me and my son were just looking through these and they are fabulous, mainly for kids' rooms. That's what I'm thinking, really, for kids' rooms. They're so wonderful. So it's a nice box. Like, look at the stars on the box. It's, it's, it's fabulous. It retailed for 20 bucks. Here's some of the prints right here, but I'm also gonna show you just like real life a couple of these because well, I'm going to show you my faves just really quick like this my faves and this one right here definitely is in the top two faves of mine so hopefully you can see can you see look at that look at that isn't that fantastic this one is another like super super favorite that is so cute and then they have this boy riding a tiger. Let's see. There's a boy riding a bear. It's just like creative. It's just going to create this creativeness. <laughs> I don't know. Create creativeness. Yeah. Like with your kids. This one right here. My top. My top. Look at that. Look at the moon. Look at the girl. Oh my gosh. Like this one is probably one that I'll keep. I probably will. I'll probably frame it and put it on my wall because it's the moon. And it's fantastic, yes. This one right here is another one that's like, look at these, OMG. A narwhal and a little girl, okay. Two kids riding a rabbit, how cool. Unicorns, okay, unicorns baby. There's a fox up in here. These are really nice card stock. They're super, super nice. They're just, they're just all like, Guys, I mean, okay, I'm going to stop because I don't want to take up all that time, but these are, as you can see, fantastical. Yes, fantabulous, fantastical, all of the above. I absolutely love them. So, I have one more bag, guys, and there is a lot of fall, it looks like, up in here. Um, I did get some of these right here because I think they're absolutely gorgeous. I don't remember the gold foil leaves, and if you know, like... If you go walking in the woods, there are leaves, you know, that look like that. Maybe not, you know, the gold, but, you know, they are just, just wispy, you know, leaves that are, that there's holes in them and they're just so cool. I just feel like it gives it such a realistic look. So they had these with the gold wispy leaves or whatever, lacy, whatever. I love this. I love these. I love these. The garland, the fall foliage garland, I love it. And they also had this one right here, which is also fall foliage garland. And this one has the red or reddish orange, wispy, lacy leaves. So I absolutely loved it. So I got one of each of those. And those are really good if you have a mailbox outside your house to wrap around the mailbox if you decorate it for fall. Love it. Or you can put it like if you're doing a fall grapevine tree or just, you know, just anything. You can do anything with it. Gonna have some happy campers. Happy campers. Okay. Oh, I got these little purple bats. Cute. Hold on. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, just the lights. I always like to get the lights every year. They're just, they're just great. 
Then I ended up getting these. These are the Thankful Harvest and Welcome. Um, I am going to be doing a couple of wreaths. One's probably going to be fall. One's probably going to be Halloween. Maybe both Halloween. I don't know yet. But I'm thinking that one of, like the Harvest. I think the Harvest one is my favorite. I think that would look really cute on a wreath. So, yeah. And then I got some socks. Yes. So, these are the Bum Men's 2-Pack. This is the Cushion Sole arch support and breathe breathability so i did get uh these two for my son i'm gonna see if my hubby i don't think my hubby will honestly um but these are perfect for like if you wear converses and stuff like that which my son lives in converses like i do um but these are perfect for that and two pair so he's gonna like that and then for me i got me some as well i got me three packs and these are the colors that they come in and i haven't been wearing socks with my converses because honestly let me just say every time i put a pair of these on they slide off my heel they do they slide off my heel and that makes for a miserable day like you have to pretend like everything is okay but deep down inside of your shoe your sock is falling off, you know? I'm not into that, but I'm hoping that these are good and don't do that. And the colors are unreal. These two right here are my faves, like the fluorescent 80s, you know, 80s and fluorescent. They go together, don't they? But these two right here are fantastic. And then we have a light pink and a, a peachy color, orange, yeah, gorgeous. And then these purple and these light blue. So these fit size, um, shoe size, does it say? Oh, five to nine. Now, mm, I wear a 10 typically. So are they all five to nine? Like... Yeah, they're all five tonight. I think they'll fit. You know, it's socks. They're going to stretch. Probably fall off my heel anyway. So, yeah. And then, last but not least, I'm a happy camper. I love my Tic Tacs. So, oh, it's not last but not least. Hold on a minute. Hold on. Hold the show. One last item. This is something I had never seen. So, this is from Spa Scriptions. It's Bedazzled. It is the Firming Glitter Peel-Off Facial Mask. Number one, if I do a mask, I like a peel-off mask. Number two, if I have the chance to do glitter, boom baby, I'm in. I'm always in for glitter. Like, every time I'm in for glitter. So, this is fantastic. Look at it. I cannot wait to use it. When I use it, maybe I'll put a picture over on Instagram. Facebook, TikTok, whatevs. But anyway, this is fantastic. So, yes. So, that is my haul, guys. It's another long one. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you did enjoy it, please consider giving it a thumbs up and leave me a comment, guys. Let me know if you eat sugar on your raisin bread. And let me know. Just let me know. Just let me know. Just let me know about anything. Just tell me your deep dark secrets okay i want to hear I'm, i do um anyway if you're not follow if you're not subscribed to my channel please hit that subscribe button don't forget when i hit uh 13k i'm going to be doing a couple of adult coloring book giveaways so be waiting for that we are um 12.8 something so it won't be long at all till we'll be 13 and i'll be doing those giveaways so that's when you need to make sure your bell icon has been pressed so you can be notified when i do those awesome giveaways so anyway just want to say thank you guys and have a great rest of your day bye